Okay, quick tip you guys. Apparently you guys are not taking advantage of this. Quick way for your body to hold more muscle tone, ladies, muscle tone, and get rid of the fat. There's this one thing that you can do that could get you results immediately as soon as you start doing it. Every night, you should be taking melatonin. There is a a thing that happens to us in our society is because we go to sleep with our phones, these bright phones, your body thinks the sun is still up. Your body thinks the sun is still up. There are the parts of your brain that secrete melatonin naturally. Your brain does this naturally. You live in healthy, your body wants to release melatonin, certain things like they seduce you into a deep, deep sleep, and the body releases all these hormones. You recover, inflammation goes away, and you wake up recovered and motivated. But your body doesn't do this because when these bright lights are on us, your body says, the sun's still up, it's not time to go to sleep, and that throws off, even if you go to sleep at midnight, or 11, or whatever late time it might be, your body still takes time to transition into that phase. And the nighttime, there's a certain rhythm, goes every 60 to 90 minutes, you go in and out of deep sleep, in and out of sleep, and it's only on those very bottom parts of the deepest sleep, REM, deepest REM sleep, where your body releases these very valuable hormones. And the fact that you wait so long for your body to then say, okay, let's transition, because it still has to get ready. You can't just immediately release the melatonin naturally. Your body says, okay, the sun's down once you put the phone away, and then you're finally trying to lay in bed, and then maybe go to sleep. But your body's still going to take maybe two hours, three hours. It might not happen at all for you to start releasing these hormones because you took so long to put that sun away, that bright light screen. They put that sun away. And the quickest way to get rid of this phenomenon is to take melatonin. Your body's supposed to secrete it naturally, but a lot of times it's not going to do that because it thinks the sun is up. So one tip I can say is stop having your phone late at night. I say put it on a charger that's away from bed because then you're not gonna be hitting the snooze. You have to at least get up to turn it off. But I say if you can, if you can, put it away. After the sun goes down, put your phone away. After you're done, after you're home at night, and you're done being productive, what are you doing anyway? If you're done being productive, you have nothing to do, a lot of us, you'll find ourselves just scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Two, three hours later, you're like, I've accomplished nothing. You look at a few memes and go, hmm, huh, and then that's it. There's, Couldn't you just be catching up on sleep? Please, you guys, put your phones away. And that's so hard for me to do personally. That's so hard for me to do. Put your phones away. Your body will start creating its own melatonin as it wants to. As it wants to. Your sleep cycles. It might take a while to get back into your sleep cycles, but if you create a routine out of it, you're start gonna living, you're gonna be starting to live a healthier, more vir- viral? You get a virility. Your body is gonna be more vibrant because it's gonna finally start optimizing itself. The arguably more important than your workouts is actually the recovery period. The recovery period is so important and people are foregoing the hormones that are released at the bottom of your deepest, deepest inception-like sleep patterns. Guys, put the phones away, take melatonin exogenously, right? I bought mine from, uh, I'll put a link in it. I'll put a link in the description for a melatonin supplement. You can get them super cheap. It might last you all year. I take a decent amount because once you start taking melatonin, it really starts to work. Anywho, guys, this is going to be a life changer for you. If you can add it to your routine, this is the basics. This is something you should be doing right away and you should be doing for damn near your whole life. This is a routine in which your body will be less fat, lots more muscle, and you will wake up every day vitalized to go attack the day. This is something you need to put into play right away. This is something you need to start doing this to your routine immediately. The results that you're going to get from doing this is something you cannot wait to start adding into your routine. The percentage, big percentage of results that you can get on top of what you're already getting. You don't know what you're missing. You've got to start doing this. Take melatonin, three, five, 10 milligrams a night. 20. Work your way up. Put your phone away. Get more sleep. When we train athletes, we say whoever sleeps the most wins. 
you know, when you're training young male, male, sometimes female athletes, whoever sleeps the most and whoever eats the most usually is the better athlete. And I'm talking like football, basketball, baseball, the big most, you know, where you've got to really exert yourself. Those kind of, you know, if you're a growing boy or even a growing girl, sleeping the most, even you 40-year-olds, sleeping the most, there's so many valuable things that happen at night that are not you scrolling Facebook, are not you scrolling Instagram, and you 40-year-olds not scrolling Pinterest and freaking watching The Bachelorette. Do that midday. Do that midday. But at nighttime is the only time your body wants to release this type of hormone, and you're going to give up the opportunity to have natural steroids in your body released. Natural steroids. This is the IGF-1 testosterone the growth hormone that people pay thousands of dollars to inject into their body because they need extra, they need more. This is something your body wants to give you naturally. Watch and don't even change your diet or exercise routine. Do this and watch how your body starts optimizing things. Watch how your body starts living at a better vibration, a better stroke when you give it some time to recover. You can hit the gym harder and that's what it's all about. But the recovery hormones... And the rest and mindfulness that you'll get from doing this properly, there's just no avoiding it. You guys have got to start doing this. Melatonin. So now that only people still watching are the advanced ones, I take 40 milligrams of melatonin a night. The trick, yeah, all those, you know, non-advanced people, they've, they've clicked off the video by now. I can be honest with you. Melatonin wears off. It's effects, just like pre-workout, it's effects. The more you take it consistently, the less you kind of feel it, the less it kicks. So honestly, the full version of the supplement, I would suggest a ZMA and sometimes mix one little five milligram tablet in with the ZMA, melatonin. There's a right mixture that you can find amazing results from. But because you guys are just now getting my advice and I know damn well you're not doing this, you could, you'd be fine with five or 10 milligrams of melatonin a night. You get them in little, they're black cherry chews. You chew them. They taste really good. Just chew them. I got them by my nightstand. You guys, melatonin, I will put a link in the description for this amazing supplement that is going to make you burn fat and build muscle and be a beast and it's guaranteed to make your IG likes go up. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. Guys, I'm feeling it. Melatonin, I'm so pumped to be finally getting quality sleep every night. I'm so pumped to be finally waking up refreshed. I feel like I deserve that. When you start going beast mode in the gym, you find that you might either burn out or you beast out. And you're not burning out if you're recovering every night. That's what it's all about, you guys. Your joints, inflammation. A lot of times your body overreacts and that's what anti-inflammatories are for. Inflammation is actually a really good response in the body. It tells, it turns your body's healing mode on because it says, ow, this hurts. It sends, I don't want to explain it all to you. I don't want to explain it all to you. I got to brief myself on this. But your body gets rid of that inflammation at night because of the rest and recovery. If you're eating properly, if you're taking the extra supplements when it comes to branched chain amino acids or a full protein profile, and you guys are eating whole foods, your body has what it needs. It wants to release this substance. I was going to say a hormone. I think it's a uh, neurotransmitter. Neurotransmitter. Melatonin, your body releases it naturally. But if you don't get your ass on Amazon and click the link that I fucking put in the description, you're going to realize that you're not going to realize that shit. You're not going to realize shit, actually, because you won't know what you're missing. You guys, the best results and the best night's sleep come from those who follow your boy's Nick. Your boy Nick's advice. You got to get some melatonin, okay? You got to get some melatonin. I don't know what else to say. I think one out of 300 people that watch this will take my advice. Click the fucking link. I see the shit. I see the shit. It's a tracking link. I see who clicks it. 
not who personally, but I see how many people click it. If you don't click this link, you won't build muscle. You won't, no, I'm just kidding. It helps, okay? This whole thing helps. I don't want to make it sound like night and day difference for you, but anytime I give advice or a principle to follow, people will see night and day difference if they follow it to a T religiously. That's when good results come, is when you take your boy Nick's advice. I'm here to help you. Me giving you advice doesn't help me in any way. But me giving you advice, you getting amazing results, eventually you'll thank me for that somehow. But that's what it's all about is I have a wealth of knowledge. A wealth of knowledge. And I want to give it to you. And we're going to start with the tip that you're not sleeping well at night. You need to take melatonin. I have a link in the description from the one that I take every night. I could show you, but I damn near ready to take some right now. Guys, get that deep night's sleep that you deserve. And I'm not talking some my pillow commercial. And those help too. I have those. Good bedding. Dark room. Oh, that's another video. Is the blackout shades. Those are night those are <laughs> night and day difference. Dark light. That's what it's all about. You got this artificial sun in your hand called a cell phone. Put that away at like seven or eight o'clock. I know it's damn near impossible, but if I can put mine away by 9 30, 10, I'm good. And then it takes me about an hour. I'm asleep. I have a decent amount of sleep every night, even though I gotta wake up at four. So the earlier you can get to it, the better. You guys are not recovering properly. That's the number one reason why you're not seeing gains, baby. You're not seeing that fat shed off of you is because you're not recovering at night and your body is rejecting the results it could potentially get. It could potentially solidify. The results are like right there, right there, that damn pokeball. You throw it, it's about to get it, but it you don't catch it. It's because you don't wait long enough. You haven't slept long enough. You want it to finally solidify inside that pokeball, right? When you throw the Pokemon ball, pew, gotta catch them all. You know, it blinks, blinks a little bit. Am I gonna catch it? Am I gonna catch it? Charizard, am I gonna catch it? And it catches it and you wake up in the morning rested and you're like, let's go. And then you can light the motherfucking fire and go beast, beast mode in the gym. But if you don't do that, if you don't get a good night's sleep, you're going to be waking up better, more excuses, more cravings. That's what happens when you don't get a good night's sleep is a lot of bad shit. I'll be honest. A lot of bad shit. And it's a downward spiral until your body forces you to sleep. And that's just one good instance of you sleeping. You're going to wake up groggy. But why don't you optimize your sleep patterns every damn day? Imagine what results you will get from any principle that you put into practice if you do it every damn day, ooh, for a year, every damn day for a year, ooh, and just go from there. You're going to see a whole nother life. Some people wake up at 3 a.m. to work out for fun. Some people go to sleep instead of scrolling on Facebook and they reap the benefits. And that's what I want for you. That's what I want for you.